Hello everybody and welcome to what is an episode 2 of our Pokemon Fire Red Randomized Nuzlocke. I am Jolt and today Professor Oak has sent us on a mission. We're gonna try to make our way up to Viridian City. Uh, we're gonna go try to pick up a package for him, a parcel. So let's make our way up through Route 1 if we can't get too many encounters. I'm not gonna do any uh, grinding right here just because just in case we get uh, something really low level for our encounter I don't want to have to one hit KO it and you know miss the opportunity for a pretty good member on the team so I'm not gonna really do any grinding yet hey you come from Palatown you know Professor Oak right his order came in can I get you to take this to him all right so with that people we have received the Professor Oak's parcel and see I told you it's not really uh, that that difficult or of a mission to do just go pick up the parcel bring it back to him and also, if it it would be greatly appreciated if you went down in the comment section and told me what you think about, um, first of all, the sound quality. I'm not sure how that's coming out. Um, I can always make adjustments. But also the speed up button. Um, it's it's going to be something that I would probably use more so in the beginning of the game rather than near the end because we're going to have the bike and the running shoes uh, pretty soon early in the game. So it's just something to kind of speed up the game, you know. It's just makes it so it's not as boring um, just so we can get to the the good parts if you know what I mean so alright I almost forgot what did you call me for alright I have a request for you two on my desk there is my invention the Pokédex it automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught it's a high-tech encyclopedia Jolt and Kaz take these with you all right, so we received the Pokédex. You can't get detailed information on Pokémon just by seeing them. You must have to catch them to obtain the complete data. So here are some tools for you to catch wild Pokémon. So with that, we have received the five Pokéballs, meaning our Nuzlocke has officially began. All right, Gramps, leave it all to me. Jolt, I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this. I know, I'll borrow a tail map for my sister. I'll tell her not to lend you one. Ha! All right, so thanks for being mean. No. All right, well, whatever. We're going to totally disregard what he just said, and we are going to go talk to his sister because he's jealous, and quite frankly, I like his sister. I think she's pretty hot. Check that out. Check that hair brand out. That's some good stuff. All right. So with that, we received the town map from Daisy. This is going to help us out a little bit in our journey to uh, see, navigate and stuff. I don't know, just simple things like that. I don't know. So without further ado, let's get our first encounter, which will be... Oh, Porygon 2. I don't know how that's going to go out for us, but uh, I guess we can see. Alright, I think what I'm going to do is try to water gun it first. Ah, oh. of course, of course, of course. Okay, well we're gonna sing it. All right, Let's see if we can't get a nice little catch on the first Pokeball here. Something nice and easy for us. So let's see, we got one, two, three. Ah, he got out. Okay. Well, he's still asleep, so we'll toss a little something at him. Definitely woke up. Okay. Attack missed. Ooh man, two Pokemon left. One more. Come on, people. Cross your fingers. Cross your eyes. Oh, okay. Well, I don't. I don't really think uh, Porygon Two would have been too good of a teammate for us. So that's that's nothing to too big to dwell on here so uh, that would have been our first encounter for the route um, too bad we couldn't have caught it any Pokemon's a good Pokemon in my opinion um, we're just gonna have to try again next time I guess we're gonna have probably two more encounters in today's episode so if we can't get something in those two then I'm gonna probably start to worry so <laughs> um, 
we're gonna go ahead heal up we're gonna also need to buy some more pokeballs and we're gonna see what else we can get for us today all right I feel like I've seen you before I don't know where but I feel like I have here I'll buy some stuff from you we're gonna go ahead and probably buy 10 yeah we'll buy 10 pokeballs just because we'll probably use a lot of them in the first little bit. Ooh, also, forgot. Gotta have an antidote. <laughs> this is the number one tool in a Nuzlocke, especially in these older games. They will mess you up. Uh, poison does kill you in these older generations. I think it's up until generation four or five. One of the two. I'm not quite sure, but the po poison outside of battle will kill you, so... It's always good to have at least one antidote on you. All right, so we found the silver powder up here. Um, I believe that randomizes or uh, sorry increases bug type moves, but also uh, I also randomized all of the items too. So uh, I would imagine we're gonna get some pretty funky items that I've never heard of before. So let's see what we can get for our second encounter which is a Skarmory okay that would definitely be a good typing for us because we do not have flying nor steel yet so let's see if we can't uh, we'll sing it and we'll throw a pokeball at it and see what we can do all right nice and ten all right I think I'm just going to use the speed up button for this a little bit. Uh, I feel like it's going to be kind of a long battle. Yeah. Woo! That was close. I don't know if I have any potions. Yes. No. No, I don't. Okay. Well, that's scary. That is very scary. So we can either try to catch the skirmery or we can kill ourselves and end the Nuzlocke. Um, I'm going to go for a sing. And I'll water gun it. Hope that doesn't kill him. Alright, he's fast asleep with red health. Let's see what we can get. This is this is very exciting. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Got one. And a two. And a three. Alright, Skarmory was caught. That could not have been any more intense, people. <laughs> I was literally shaking in my chair. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and give him a nickname, and I'm gonna nickname him when I nickname all of my Skarmories. Uh, I don't know why I do this, but, uh, I don't know, just something that I've always done. So with that, we have added Spike to the team. We're gonna, I think, go ahead and heal up and probably buy some potions, because I thought we grabbed a potion, but I guess we didn't. So, uh, we're gonna go ahead and heal up here. Scoop up probably one or two of these potions. There you go. We'll get three. See, that's all we can buy. Nope. Alright. So I think I'm going to try to get one more encounter right up. Uh, I, I forget the route's name exactly, but we're going to learn how to catch Pokemon after we've already caught two Pokemon. So I'm just going to speed through this. It's not really important or relevant to the game at all, so... Oh, I take that back. We've got the Tichi TV. All right, so here we are on Route 2, folks. We're going to try to get our third and final encounter for today's episode. Um, so let's see what we can get. Do, 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 do. Anytime now. Feel free. There you go. All right, we have an Ursaring. Okay, that is definitely something I can work with. Uh, if we get him, we're going to have a pretty powerful team. I think I'm going to go ahead and sing it to sleep. Just so I don't have to take any damage. We're going to water gun it. We'll probably try to go for another water gun. Alright, we got him in red health with sleep. Let's see if we can't get something. And we've caught Teddy. Or, or excuse me, Ursaring. So his dad was added to the Pokedex. And yes, we're going to give it a nickname. Since it's a male, I think I'm going to go ahead and give one of my friends a shout out here. Don't quite know why he calls himself this. But he does, nevertheless. So pretty long name though so bear with me here bear with me ah.
Alright, perfect. Ted Grizzy. Don't quite know why he calls himself that. I think he just thinks he's a bear or something, but I don't know. It's a pretty cool nickname. Thought I'd just give him a little shout out there. So, I think we might wrap up. Actually, no. I think we'll go and get one more encounter for us, just because I'm feeling a little bit greedy today. No, I don't want to heal up again. I'm not that greedy. So, we're going to make our way up into... Viridian Forest. And we will see what we can get for today to end off the episode. Hopefully on a good note. I don't know. We'll have to see what we get. Actually, there is an item over here. I'm curious to see what this is. But first, our encounter. Ooh, an Electabuzz. That's something. All right. Um, for those of you that don't know, my favorite typing is Electro-type. You probably know by the name. Uh, favorite Pokemon's Jolteon, but any Electric-type is my buddy. I like Electrics, so... This is very nice to know that we can have something nice on our team like this. I think I'm gonna go ahead and Pokeball it just in case of like a crit or something. We'll see. I'll probably throw this one if it doesn't catch him. Yeah, I'll probably shoot him with another water gun. So let's see if we can't kill it. I don't think at this point in uh, its level it has any electric type moves, so I'm not too worried about it, but I think he just has quick attack, but I'm not sure. Nevertheless, we put him to sleep. He can't attack, so I'm feeling, feeling pretty good about that. One, two, three. Oh, alright. I think I'm just gonna speed up through this a little bit. Got two more Pokeballs, and with that, we have caught Electabuzz. So, yes, we're gonna give it a nickname, and for any of you that watches the anime, you will definitely get this ref reference. Blah, 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 blah. All right, um, that's just elect uh, the way Electabuzz says his name, or what he says in the anime, so it's pretty weird. Uh, we got an Everstone, probably not going to use that. Um, but with that, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to end off there, and in the next episode, we will make our way through Viridian Forest. If you liked the video, please make sure you like it by showing your support in down below. If you would like to subscribe for more future content, don't be afraid to smash the like button. And until then, stay shocking.